uh, maybe if you could just obviously we have a stretch of seven games left here and uh, some disappointment obviously comes with it but maybe an opportunity here down the stretch what do you see as maybe you know the optimistic optimistic side of things when you look down and, and an opportunity to finish these final seven games yeah I mean it's it's the NHL I think everyone's grateful to be here and um, I think everyone's just uh, excited to kind of play for each other um, the last stretch here. Yeah. You guys obviously I mean, got eliminated from playoff contention, but on the other hand, like nobody in this province really cares where the Oilers and Flames are in the standings. It's a big game that people you know want their team to win. So you guys just, I imagine it's pretty easy to get hyped up for tomorrow either way. Yeah? Definitely, yeah. <laughs> it's always exciting playing them. Um, so like you said, I mean, I think every game kind of go in the same you like, but there maybe is a little more excitement with with that team. How would, you, how would you sum up the past year? Like it's been just over a year since you signed, arrived in Calgary. How would you sort of sum up everything you've learned in that stretch? Yeah, it's I don't know how to sum it up. It's definitely a lot. Um, definitely, I've learned a lot in the last year. Um, seen a lot, like been, but it's all been good, and um, I think it's all been steps in the right direction so um, it's it's been a good year. Has, yeah. your, has your comfort level changed at all on this latest chance at this level? Yeah I think so I think definitely um, I think just continuing to build and um, try to improve and um, that's really just kind of what my focus is going down the stretch to. Are there specific things that like with seven games left you're like okay hey, I want to accomplish this or do this or you know prove to myself that yeah I want to continue to be uh, be good with with the little details and be trusted but I think I also want to uh, contribute offensively however I can make some plays um, and find the right times to do that Hus mentioned uh, what he's seen in terms of the details like and how much that's improved in your game I, I wonder when you look at trying to build trust with the coaching staff, you know, what that process looks like as a player, you know, trying to make sure that you're trustworthy in whatever situation they throw you. Yeah, well, trust is super important. Um, you want to have trust from your teammates, but but definitely the coach too, um, so that you're playing more and out in situations you want to be in. Um, and I think trust and, and responsibility is probably the, the first thing, to, the first step into um, really getting to the top of your game.